Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'll show you how you can easily remove your green screen background even if your lighting is extremely bad and your hair looks so messy. So I've seen a lot of tutorials on YouTube, but every time I try doing it myself, the hair would look messy and it just never works. However, I just figured out an extremely easy and effective solution which I'll share with you in this video. But I need a promise from you and that is that if this video helps you, you must subscribe to the channel and let me know in the comments section how easy it was for you to remove your background following the steps that I'm about to mention in this video. Without further ado, let's begin. So now we are on my computer screen and we're going to remove the background of this particular clip. Let me go ahead and first of all import this clip onto my timeline. So let's go ahead and drag this clip onto my timeline. Here's the clip. I'll go ahead and drag it on my timeline. So you can see this is the clip, the background, the green screen, it has a lot of wrinkles on it. The background is not looking so good. And if I go ahead and do the normal way, you would see that there are, there'll be a lot of issues with this because I've tried it multiple times and never worked for me. So the way you remove green screen, first of all, we'll crop the extra parts from this footage. So let's go ahead and drop the crop tool and drop the left, right and top areas from this. So we are left with the actual footage. So I'm going to crop it from the top here as well. Now that it's looking good, we're going to look for ultra key from the effects panel and drop it on the timeline on the footage. Scroll down and you need to click on the pencil icon. So click on the pencil icon and this is the normal way. This is how everyone tells you to do it. If I do it this way, and if I go to alpha channel, you guys can see that there are a lot of issues. Now I can go ahead and mess around with these tools, but the end result is just never, never satisfactory. See, I'm going to mess with these tools and you guys can see it looks black and white, should be pretty good, right? Let's just go ahead and play this video for a second and you guys can see there are a lot of, there are a lot of issues. You guys can see the hair looks so messy and this is just not good. Let me go ahead and mute this clip for a moment. What we're going to do is we, we're not going to follow this. We are in fact going to follow another method. And it's pretty similar. However, there's a very, very small trick that you need to apply. And that trick is click on the pencil icon, select, go to alpha channel. And from here, go to aggressive. As you guys can see, there are still imperfections, but wait for it. I'll go ahead and click on the pencil icon again. I'll select it again. If it doesn't work, that's fine. Click on the pencil icon again, click on a different area. And as you guys can see, it is completely black and white. And let me tell you, this is way better than it was before. Let me show you. Let me full screen this and play it for you. Now you guys can see the hair are looking a lot better. Let me go ahead and apply a background to this so that you guys can see how it looks with the background. So let's go to project. Let's pick this background. Let me go ahead and apply this. I'll go ahead and set this to frame size, increase the size a little bit. And I'll go ahead and first of all, let me zoom the video in a little bit so you can see better. Okay, let me full screen and play it for you. You guys can see it is looking perfect you can see the the hair the detail in the hair you don't you don't see green color anywhere so this is how to properly remove your green screen from your video background it's just that you have to try the ultra key with aggressive setting once twice thrice click on different areas and ultimately it is going to work. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'll catch you in the next video. Thank you, bye-bye.